Welcome back to Final Fantasy 3. Because you don't want to let candles burn for too long or too short. Right. Because if you let them burn too short, that's how you get, like, thin hole. If you let them burn too long, then I don't know. See what it said? It just kind of all blacks out. <gasps> if you need a push, I'll be right there behind you. Do you know who that is? If you need a push? Uh... That was Ardbert. Ardbert, okay. Remember him? The one that looked like me? Yep. Don't recognize that. That's me. Horchafont. These are all <gasps> people. These are all people you've met in your yeah, journey. Yeah, I figured. What we have sown in blood, we have reaped in suffering, and it cannot go on. Moonbrita? No, that's Meryl Whip. She's the oh, leader Meryl of Limsa. She's the... Wait, isn't she still alive though? Yeah. They who have sacrificed themselves to pave the way for peace. We will never abandon our cause. That one's Amrick. That is Amrick. Yes. Good. My boy. <laughs> That's uh, little, the little girl Lala in charge of Uldah. That's what I thought. Rodan. Raban. Raban. Close. Sorry. Elden, <laughs> Elden Ring. Ring. You're close. <laughs> Connie Senna, your least favorite, the leader of Gridania. Yep. Yeah. She's not my least favorite. I just don't like her hair. That one's Hien. That is Hien. Good job remembering that, even though it's been a long time. His voice, his accent is very distinct. I yeah. think that's why I remember. That one, I'm not sure. That's Papa Limo. You haven't seen him in forever because he's been dead yeah. since Heaven's Sword. A future shaped by the choices we make in ways we could never have That's Count Edmund. He's Horchafon's dad, and okay. he's the one that wrote the book. Yeah. That one's. Um... You can stop walking to think if you. That's Beck Lugs, that brown girl with the droopy ears and helped you get oh, back home. Okay. Yeah. I was not thinking that character. That was a very short sentence, I didn't really. That's Reen. Oh, Reen. Yeah. Rhine? Reen, Rhine. It's one of the dragons, isn't it? Midgard Somer. The king of dragons. He was the only one that spoke our language. Yeah. I'm really not good at recognizing most of the That's Minfilia. And the last one. I've never heard Minfilia's voice yeah. in forever either. Is that Thancred? It's Ardbert. Oh, Ardbert. He's the first and last one. There it is. Leon! You! Stink. <laughs> Trash! You dumb harpy. Harpy of death! Harpy bigot. I've come to kill you. Here the path ends. There is no way to reach our nest. You can set the auto if you'd like. I forgot that I turned it off. The reason I split this is because this is a very long cutscene. <gasps> they didn't give me the warning. No. I told you. Resignation and acceptance reign in this place. <clears throat> the rejection of life by those who came to curse it. Those whose dreams were unfulfilled, whose prayers were unheard, whose labors were unrewarded. Hope cannot deliver you unto hopelessness. Our refuge is beyond you. Always has it been. Such is the nature of this place. You should have remained on a Theris. Struggle will avail you not, nor will it grant your comrades peace. Come, 
Let me relieve you of your burden. You have suffered enough. Well, I just don't want to die. Sorry. Oh well, yeah, we have this trick we haven't used yet. Yep. This is going to get us the rest of the way there. So long as our souls remain, you can use it to summon us back. But you mustn't. How do we make peace? That's why it's too soon for this to end. You must try and try. Be safe, all of you, and come back. I was hoping for. So long as we remember, our fates remain ours to shape. Perhaps when our time comes to return to the star, we shall remember these few days we have lost. Do not squander it. The legacy I leave you. What would you say? <laughs> Using a cheating freaking crystal. Hey, it's not cheating. You can only use it one time. Oh, okay. <gasps> We're summoning our ancient friends you picked those ones huh i bid them remember but all this time i'm the one who had forgotten a right fool you've made of me hermes and to add insult to injury i've been denied a sound rest forced to watch this clamorous show oh, come now it's been a gripping tale Unbreakable bonds and noble sacrifice sprinkled with moments of levity to counterbalance the pathos. It's got it all. Good old Hythodis. Either one would have been perfect. How did you know? Hythodis <laughs> and um, Emmett Sulk are some of my favorite characters too. Yeah. The, I mean, everyone loves them. Amorick. He's, he's having fun with it. What are you? Half-faded souls of the dead. Isn't it painfully obvious? Worry not. We haven't the power to defeat you. Nor is it our duty to do so. Not so what does the top option give me different people? No, it's the same. Okay. Because your comment made that it sound like it, no. it would have. <laughs> don't have a score to settle. Uh-oh. So here I am, Vanar. I suppose you needed me to tie it all together, these frayed threads of our history. But knowing you, I suspect there's a joke in it too. Oh yes, I can imagine you gloating over my forgetfulness. Were I feeling charitable, I might assume you'd have left room for the possibility of this outcome. Even so, You'll get no applause from me. A single gesture will not lighten the burden I've had to bear. Sounds Still, a little bitter. You must be commended. Our methods would not have brought mankind this far. And so, as a show of respect to the last of us, I make this declaration. You will not end our journey. That is our answer. The answer of all lives of Atheris, past and present. As you've called us to the stage, so shall we perform. And creation magic 
just never go with things. He's just having fun with it. <laughs> yep. upon the hopes of your comrades, we will make for you a new path. What form said path takes depends on you. So focus. Focus and envision that which rejects the claim that you cannot attain your goal. Ours is the wisdom to weave the fabric of reality. Ours is the power to create. It's that signature thingy he does. The finger snap. He made a bunch of flowers. Yeah, he did. Meet you. Though I gave you these wings to soar the heavens. I did not teach you how to walk the earth. So loath was I to bind another living being. In the course of your long journey, you will learn from those you meet. Learn to walk and run. And so much more. A flower. Yes. Upon your return, I will gift you a beautiful flower. These Elpis blooms serve as proof that this realm is not utterly devoid of hope. No more can you deny its power. No more is yours the dominion of despair. In case the practical implications were lost on you, your comrades no longer need fight their fight. So go on. Call them back to your side. We're gonna get all our friends oh, back. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, good. I would have been very upset if they stayed dead. Yeah, and just kill them off that fast? No way. They had such unceremonious unceremonious disappearances. Yep. They were just gone one second. It was not fun. I should say not satisfying. It's never fun to have them die. May you ever walk in the light. Ha oh, ha, I can resurrect. Ah, how disappointing. Not even a single scar in the making to brag about. Of course. You'll find a way regardless. Yeah, just grab a rock and scrape it on your cheek. <laughs> Honestly, this is far more than any of us could have hoped for. Let us be thankful. Indeed, that we thus stand reunited is a gift. Let us not squander it, and see that we all return to its ends. Aye, as soon as we've averted the final days. Good to see you again. Our heroic sacrifice paid off, I take it. Come, my friends. Let us carry on and finish it. Together. Together! You don't have to do it alone. The power of friendship compels you. <laughs> there she is. Pick one. Sun is opening. I would have never thought of a dead sun to be a rock. 
I would giant think it, rock that cooled down, I guess. I would think of it to be more of a black hole. Oh well. This looks really weird. It does. It's a giant blob. It, it moves like a water droplet, but it's solid like a stone. That's the real Medion in there talking. Yep. The way is open. They can proceed. So it seems. We're gonna go back to being dead. You're leaving. Of course. The encore is finished, and I will not suffer myself to live again by Hydeleen's magic. But more than that, the future you seek is not the past we loved. That is why we fought, and why I lost. Remember fighting him? Yep. Yep, Hades. But though you defeated me, my ideals are inviolate, invincible. Spare me your pity. I have no use for it. If you would do something for me, save our star. See this tale to a triumphant conclusion, and with elation in your hearts, bid the final curtain fall. Only then may it rise again, and a new tale begin, with new parts for all to play. Have you been to the ruins beneath the waters of the Bounty? Or the treasure islands beyond the frozen waters of Blind Frost in Offerhurt's North? The fabled golden cities of the New World? The sacred sites of the forgotten people of the South Sea Isles? What about Mericidia, the southern continent? Do you know aught of its present state of affairs? I thought not. Even of your little Eorzea, you know precious little. The true identities of the Twelve. He's right. For There's instance. so much on Etheris itself we can still explore and we haven't. Which is to say, expand your horizons. Go forth. Basically him talking about future scope. expansions, people say. Some it could be. Yeah. Exploring areas on your planet you haven't seen yet. As the bearer of Azem's crystal, you may consider your duty to see at least that much. I certainly did. I pray we meet again. If not in this life, then perhaps another. Whensoever it should be, I trust it will be a most joyous reunion. To you, maybe. I want nothing to do with Such it. Such a souvenir, <laughs> man. Good intentions, just doesn't like people, I guess. Yep. <laughs>
there they go. What was it about the 12? I feel like there's... That's the 12 original gods that created the universe and everything. Oh, that's what I meant. Yeah. Okay. It, the games have really gotten into it at all. Look at that, they're all here. Yeah! Talk to Alphano. Talk to him. Thought I did. <gasps> look at the quest. Look at the quest. And just, just start it, and we're gonna stop in just a moment. Okay. And Welker. <laughs> the name. Yep. You know what that means? It's the final quest. Final boss. Are you ready, Victoria? You've done over 500 episodes. You ready to be done with this crap? Zeno's gonna show up out of nowhere. For now. This is it. She's the only one that does that. <laughs> I didn't see if Graha did a thumbs up though. I felt like he would have there. Pick one, Tyler. This is it. Oh crap, you did it too. I honestly feel like that's the emote that would have happened hey. regardless of choice right there. You're the dead end, yeah, It's the final dungeon. In the next episode, Tyler will do the dead ends and do the final quest. Wait, is it a dungeon or is it, it the final final boss? Well, the final the final quest of an expansion gives both a final boss and dungeon. Oh, okay. The dungeon usually leads up to that final boss. Okay. See ya. See you next week, friends. <laughs>